It is always a pleasure to come back to Dhaka. This is not my first visit and I'm certain it's not going to be my last. Uh, the reason is I feel at home here. We have a shared history and more importantly, we have a shared mother tongue. And last but not the least, Dhaka is a city which is full of book lovers and beautiful uh, bookshops uh, like the Reading Cafe where we had a program today. So this is my debut novel. Uh, it's a historical fiction novel and uh, hopefully a uh, well-researched one. My readers shall decide. It's about uh, the world's most precious diamond and it happens to be a red diamond which is very very rare and uh, so this diamond was mined hundreds of years ago from the same Kolur mine which gave the world the Kohinoor and the Daryainoor which are very very famous jewels so why don't, don't we know about the Asmainoor uh, well uh, I will not disclose the whole story but it has had a bloody and a secretive history as compared to the other uh, jewels, more bloody and more secretive. And the setting of the story is sometime before uh, the Battle of Plassey during the Mughal era, uh, covers that entire era of the Battle of Plassey and sometime later. And the interesting thing about it is that there is a section of the story which is set in the modern day because we have uh, two treasure hunters who are actually historians but they are hunting for this treasure uh, they are from two different parts of the world one is a British scholar and one is an Indian historian and they happen to be looking for the Asmainu so have, they have to follow uh, a trail of historical clues in order to arrive at the answer to the question did the Asmainu really exist if so, where is it?